Hi everyone, I'm Kelly. I work at the Vineland Public Library Information Desk and I am going to show you how to use EBSCO to get free ebooks. So EBSCO is a company that offers research databases, uh, magazine subscriptions, ebooks to libraries and now through June they are offering a great deal of their things for free due to the COVID-19 uh, tragedy. So thank you. EBSCO for doing that. Uh, this website that you're looking at right now is the New Jersey State Library. They put all the links they're offering for free up in a nice little place right here. So we'll make sure we post that link for you with this video. Uh, so there's a lot you can do. There's academic searches, business source, ultimate, um, ebooks, academic collection, public library, there's also things for teens, young adults, children, kindergarten through eighth grade. Since I work downstairs in the reference department, I want to focus on things that would be most beneficial to our adult patrons. So I'm going to go ahead and click on this link right here, the ebooks for public library collection. When you click on it, you know, you don't have the browsing capabilities that you might be using do when using OverDrive, which is how you can access free books and audiobooks using your Vineland Library card. However, there are ways to browse, and I would like to show you how to do that. So let's say you're a fan of mystery books. You can go ahead and type mystery into the search bar here. And we're going to get a lot of results. We end up with 2,073 results. So you could go through all 2,073 results. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, let's say you like number five, Daffodil Mystery. Click on it. Most of them have a little description that tells you what the book's about. You click on EPUB full text over here and you get your book. Some of them are PDFs, but you know, you can look through and read your book, okay? But if you want to narrow things down a little bit, so bad, you can look over here on the side. Maybe you want to read books that are more current. So maybe you want to limit publication date. Maybe you don't care. Whatever you want to do, that's an option. You can also limit things by subject, publisher, language, category. So there are some books available in different languages. I see, think that a uh, Subject and category are very similar, so, but you can kind of get an idea. Detective and mystery stories, murder investigations, um, some of these have children's books, fictions, thrillers, suspense. Well, I like thrillers, so I'm going to go ahead and click there, bring up the list of mysteries that are thrillers and suspense. So, again, maybe I think this one looks good. Click on it, read what it's about, and then click here to download it. But there's not just fiction on here. There's also a great deal of nonfiction. So you could go ahead and search cookbook. If you want a recipe to try out. And we're going to get some cookbooks. And again, you can limit things. Maybe you just want vegan cookbooks or vegetarian cooking. Now you could go ahead and just type this in the search bar, but if you want to kind of see what, well, everything they have to offer, you can you know, just type in cookbook and then limit things down. Um, another thing for cookbooks in the library world, it's called cookery. So. I got 427 with cookbook, but when I search cookery, I get 1,243 results. So don't forget, um, if you're looking for cookbooks, type in cookery. I have a lot of people ask me for bestsellers. So you could type in, in quotation marks, New York Times bestseller, bestseller quote. Make sure you put the quotes in because it We'll search all of those words together. So I go ahead and I search now. 
34. I thought I had more results than that last time. That's okay. So let's just say I like this little cowboy jewelry to five styles. So go in, you can see that it's finding out New York Times bestseller and pulled that from there and it was able to bring up that. You can also go into the advanced search and search, you know, maybe you want to search for a person or biography. Oh, oh. I want his name, Martin Luther King Jr. And then I want to make sure that I put in biography so I get books, you know, that are biographies and not just something that mentions him. And I hit search. And of course, now I get my biography on him. Um, so I hope this will be helpful. And I hope that you will find some cool things on here to read. If you have questions, just email us at reference at or We can always try to help you find things on here. But big thanks to EBSCO, and I hope everyone is doing well. Stay safe, be healthy, have a lovely day. Bye-bye.